In this single dimly lit direct room, inside Nalufenya Detention Facility is where Kamwenge Town Council Mayor Geoffrey Biamukama was incarcerated. In May, NTV secretly filmed Biamukama when he was hospitalized at Nakasero Hospital with serious wounds on his knees and legs. The pictures elicited an uproar from the public. Biamukama had been tortured by police officers who arrested him on 5th April from the Ministry of Land's offices. However, Biamukama today looked visibly healthy and could walk by himself. He narrated the torture he went through before being dumped at Nalfenya, which included severe beating with batons and metals. He revealed that he was tortured in order to extract a confession from him that he killed Assistant Inspector General of Police Andrew Felix Kawesi. After handcuffing me, now from where of course I could not turn left or neither right because they handcuffed me both the arms and the leg. He started now torturing seriously. Two were using the batons at the, at the knees and the other two were using an iron, a short iron bar like the one of a window. He's worsening health forced police to take him to Ginger Hospital and later Nakasero for treatment. They looked at the legs and thought maybe this guy will need to amputate the legs. But later, they had a meeting, I think, and decided, hey, let's take him to the theater and we see if we can manage him. I was taken to the theater first time, second time, then later they said, no, this man, is, I think, is manageable, can you treat him. Biamukama says on 17th March when Kawesi was murdered in Kulambiro, a Kampala suburb, he was in Kamwenge moderating a council meeting. I, I know there was nothing, because even that time was not in Kampala. That's why, why I'm saying I was totally innocent, because I was in Kamwenge that very day on 17th of March. I was in Kamwenge town council. Not that I was in Kamwenge town council, I had even a council meeting. He also denied any connection with the Allied Democratic Forces, a rebel group accused of masterminding several murders in the country. So I was one of the mobilizers in the district heading the district and in charge <coughs> of the home guards and LDUs in the district to mobilize all the vigilantes against the ADF. So I think there's no way, of course, except that maybe anyway. Police is yet to sanction any charges against Biamukama, despite spending five months in their custody. According to the DPP, the, the evidence that we have on our file is not adequate enough uh, to have him on our charges. So we have given him bond and uh, he's going to continue cooperating with us. One of the terms of his bond is to report every after 14 days at CPS Kampara. Habad Ziwa. NTV Weekend Edition.